The ABCs of Black History Month. A is for Africa, the birthplace of humanity and civilization and the second largest continent in the world. B is for Barack Obama, the first African-American president of the United States. C is for the Civil Rights Act, the 1964 law which ended segregation in public places and employment discrimination on the basis of identity. D is for Dred Scott, an enslaved black man who unsuccessfully appealed to the U.S. Supreme Court for his freedom in 1857. E is for emancipation. President Abe Lincoln freed millions of enslaved people when he issued the Emancipation Proclamation on January 1, 1863. F is for Freedom Riders, civil rights activists who took bus trips called Freedom Rides through the South in 1961 to protest segregated bus terminals. G is for the Greensboro Four, the North Carolina a and freshmen who sat at a whites-only lunch counter to protest segregation. Their actions sparked nationwide sit-ins. H is for the Harlem Renaissance, the intellectual, social, and artistic explosion that occurred in Harlem, other northern cities, and Paris that span the 1920s. I is for Ida B. Wells, a journalist and educator who fought against racism, lynching, and sexism. She was also one of the founders of the NAACP. J is for Jackie Robinson, the first African-American to play Major League Baseball in the modern era. He joined the Brooklyn Dodgers in 1947. K is for Katherine Johnson, a mathematician at NASA whose calculations were critical to the success of the first U.S. manned space flight. L is for the Little Rock Nine, the nine students who integrated Little Rock Central High School in 1957. The U.S. Army protected the students from violence. M is for Martin Luther King Jr., the most prominent figure of the civil rights movement who led peaceful protests against racial and social inequality in America. N is for the NAACP, the civil rights organization founded in 1909 to ensure the political, educational, social, and economic equality of all people. O is for Oprah Winfrey, a media executive, philanthropist, actress, talk show host, TV producer, and North America's first black multi-billionaire. P is for Phyllis Wheatley, an enslaved West African who was sold to a family in Boston. She would become the first published black female poet. Q is for Lloyd Quarterman, one of the few black scientists to work on the Manhattan Project, a top secret effort to build the atomic bomb during World War II. R is for Rosa Parks, an activist who refused to give up her seat to a white rider on a segregated bus. This helped spark the Montgomery bus boycott. S is for Shirley Chisholm, the first black woman elected to Congress and the first woman to run for the Democratic Party's presidential nomination. T is for Thurgood Marshall, a lawyer who won several important cases before the Supreme Court before becoming the first black Supreme Court justice. U is for the Underground Railroad, a network of secret routes and safe houses used by enslaved people to escape to free states and Canada with the aid of allies. V is for the Voting Rights Act, the landmark piece of federal legislation enacted in 1965 to protect voting rights for racial minorities, especially in the South. W is for Wilma Rudolph, the athlete who overcame polio, racism, and sexism to become the first American woman to win three gold medals in a single Olympics. X is for Xavier University. Xavier University of Louisiana is a liberal arts college that is the only historically black Roman Catholic college institution in the U.S. Y is for York, an enslaved man who participated in the Lewis and Clark expedition across the western U.S. as an explorer and hunter. Z is for Zora Neale Hurston, an author, anthropologist, and a central figure of the Harlem Renaissance, whose work highlighted racial struggles in the South. Black history is American history.